Hey, what's up? It's me, Jessica J, and I was just wondering if you've ever sat and thought to yourself, uh, are there like certain things that make me look feminine? Well, if so, I'm glad you asked because there are some things that will make you look more womanly than us. I'm gonna tell you what they are so you can choose whether or not you wanna keep looking like that. Cause that's your life. If you wanna look like me, then that's cool. But if you don't wanna be seen as feminine as Miss Jessica Jai, then we can cut that stuff out right now. And to make sure you're not accidentally cutting women out of your life, looking as feminine as you may be looking, don't forget to hit this subscribe button right here, right now. Or maybe after you find out that you do look like a woman and you'd like to learn more tips from me from here on out. So there's a lot of trends out there that you you know, may work for men today, that won't work for men tomorrow. So I'm gonna kinda go over some universal things that are unacceptable. Cause I saw that men are wearing like dresses and skirts now and I'm not gonna lie, some of them look pretty cute. So starting with number one, uh, I'm never, I'm never ever gonna think this looks manly is skinny jeans. I mean, fine if you like the way your butt looks in skinny jeans, keep doing it. I'm just telling you, it looks pretty feminine. Why does it look pretty feminine? Because we women wear skinny jeans, so you can look at our butt. But because men always wanna take the things that we're good at and make it your own to be good at, like yoga. You know, men out there now are wearing motherfucking skinny jeans and pulling it off, fine. But I'm telling you, it looks feminine. Number three is uh, wearing earrings. Okay, fine, there was a time when like, if you wore one earring, it was like, you know, pretty cool, bro. But like nowadays, uh, when I see a guy with an earring, I'm like, oh my God, what a douche. I just don't see any room for men with earrings this day and age. I just I can't, I just can't, I try, I can't. And don't get me wrong, every guy I've dated in the past, you know, had like an earring. <laughs> But now that I'm thinking about it, I'm like, oh my God, that looks so bad. And now that we're on the subject of jewelry, wearing too much jewelry looks too much like me. I get it, you got style, you're rock and roll. But if you've got like more necklaces and more bracelets than I do, I'm gonna start thinking about how we should have a shopping date together and never ever go to pound town. Number four is wearing too much chapstick. I get it, your lips must be dry just as my lips are dry in like this summer heat or like in the winter cold. But is that chapstick or is that jizz on your lips? I can't even tell. Number five is, I don't know, it, uh, this used to be a thing back in like the NSYNC and Backstreet Boy days, but it's not a thing anymore, which is hair highlights. You wanna color your grays, fine. You wanna, you wanna have a different color hair, fine. But don't like biolage. Where's a balayage? Don't have like two different colors. That's, that's, we women do that. We're the ones who like play with our hair and like colors in our hair, yay. You're a man, you don't have time to think about having two different hair colors. Unless it's like salt and pepper, that's sexy. And now that we're on the subject of hair, we're actually gonna stay on the subject of hair. But number six is having a lot of product in your hair. Listen, all my gay guy friends wear a lot of product in their hair. If you're a straight guy, you shouldn't. If I can tell that you have product in your hair, you have too much product in your hair. And then I'm gonna talk to you about the product in your hair instead of you putting your penis in my mouth. And number seven, which is having long hair if you're a skinnier guy. Listen, women, we're smaller than you guys. So if you have like a smaller frame and you have long hair, you look like a girl. I'm sorry. My brother is basically like my frame and he used to rock hair as long as mine. So when me, him, my mom and my sister would walk down the street like nobody could tell us apart. And that's not a good thing. So those are the seven items or things that may be making you look a little feminine. And if you know you don't want to, then you can cut that shit out. But if you know that that's your look, fuck it. Find a girl who love you for the feminine looking figure that you have. And to make sure you're not making any of the other mistakes that guys out there are making, again, don't forget to check out my 10 mistakes that most guys make. Thanks for watching as always, and I'll see you guys next time.